Hi, it's Martin Chow. My weekly video this week is going to cover progress, a COVID update, and my thoughts on wellbeing. So first of all, progress. We now really are in the final stages of restarting Magnox, which is a fantastic achievement. And we've reintroduced spent fuel back into the, the front end of Magnox processing for the first time since March. So great progress there in terms of getting Magnox up and running again, a significant milestone for us all at Sellafield. This week on SRP, our repackaging plant, we have now completed most of the work in terms of the major project baseline, that's the cost and the, the schedule for that, that significant project for Sellafield. And on site, we've completed the ninth pour of the concrete, putting down the base slab for the SRP facility into the long-term future. So again, great progress in the offices and site on SRP. Moving to COVID, we need to have increased vigilance for COVID. We are seeing infection rates increasing in community across the country, as I'm sure you've seen on the news. And that's been reflected somewhat in some increased positive results through our Tet Sellafield testing facility. So we are seeing some, albeit small number, of increased cases at Sellafield. This week, we've seen a number of cases in the same area at Sellafield emphasising the importance for us to follow our risk assessments and make sure that we all take care as we're coming to work and follow the, the workplace distancing that we've set out. So we will remain vigilant and it's important that everybody at Sellafield does indeed do that. I wanted to speak to you about wellbeing and Saturday is the World um, Mental Health Day. Really a chance for us to reflect on where we are with wellbeing. It's been a difficult 2020 for, for many, many people and many people I'm speaking to today, many of our colleagues at Sellafield, and we've had to adapt a great deal in terms of how we work and how we live our lives as well. And for some people, it's been a lonely time. We haven't been able to reach out to friends and family in the way that we normally would. Our support networks have been somewhat limited in that time. What I want to ask you all to do is to think about your friends and colleagues, call them not just about work matters, about things we need to discuss, but about how they're feeling, how they're doing, how their mental health is. And also think for yourself, how are you doing? Is there things that you can do to make your mental health better and to make life better for you and your colleagues? Take the time to look after each other and discuss those type of things with the people that are close to you. That was it for me this week. I hope you found that useful, quite a short video update this, for me this week. I'll be back up to Cumbria next week and on the main site. I hope to see you there soon. Stay safe, be kind.